What's up, my guy? Yo, this is this is my boy, one of my closest friends, my guy G. Um, I, I don't even want to get into what you do, but I appreciate you for coming to sessions. Yeah, you know I mean, I'm here. I'm here. He's literally a conglomerate at this point. We franchising. We going overseas. We international now, baby. California stores. I don't even know what's next. We got a new uh, warehouse. I just want a piece. I just want a piece. Can I? Can I get five out? I, I just go to work every day. <laughs> I just want five out. <laughs> can I get five out? That's what I'm trying to. So introduce yourself to the people. Tell them who you are. Tell them what you do. Uh, I'm Galen Thomas. Uh, I'm a gelatieri. I make gelato and sorbet. I have a company called Cloud Cups. We've been in business for about three years now. What is a gelatieri? <laughs> Yo, for real, like, what is that? Uh, I'm a gelato chef. Okay, um, okay. Gelato is Italian. Yep. It's yep. an Italian word for a uh, gelato chef. It's gelatieri. So, so, so I'm a gelatieri. I was trading by Italians to make gelato. So, <laughs> so you went to Italy to learn. I'm going to use all the titles they gave. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Another one. Yeah, no. <laughs> Yo, I'm hey, I'm not mad at that. So you literally learned how to make gelato. Like, where did this come from? So what's the brainchild? What what happened? So basically, um, I really wanted to make an edible bed, but I was like, I'm not just gonna do. You gotta hold your mic a little. I can't just do um, a regular brownie or anything like that. I can't just do everything run of the mill. Um, so <clears throat> I took a trip to Sacramento. What yeah. wait what year is that? So like give us a time frame because like it's a lot of stuff going um, on in that world. It's like 2000... 2018. Okay. Okay. So everything we're getting legalizations. Everywhere. It's really not. It's really like 2017. Okay. End of 2016, 2017. Cool. Take cool. the trip out to Cali. Cool. I gotta see everything. Yep. Go to 80 dispensaries up and down the coastline and rent the bins. Think I'm the man. <laughs> Cause you are the man. <laughs> he already was Rally out here. All here. around California, Look. checking out every dispensary. What do y'all got in there? Yep. What's something y'all don't got in there? Just trying to like, just just gauge Pick. the marketplace. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, You're doing market data analysis. Yep. So I get down to LA, go all around LA, yada yada yada. I see nobody has a frozen frozen section. I'm like, okay, there it is. Boom. I don't know how I'm about to get this done yet, but we're going to get there. Damn. So, <clears throat> come back home, do a whole bunch of stuff. We end up coming up with a product So me and my friends. Yeah. Uh, chocolate gelato Ooh. infused with THC. Ooh. <laughs> me. So, give it to our friends. We don't know what the hell we're doing. Everybody smacked on their ass. <laughs> <laughs> We gonna have to tweak this a little bit, y'all. <laughs> it's a little too much. A little bit too strong right now. So initially, uh, initially, uh, eventually, we get the uh, the recipe right. Bam, we have fifty milligrams a cup. Okay, cool. So that's your little. Okay, that's our, that's our four ounce cups. Gotcha. Um, so we drop those. I'm selling them out the trunk of my car. Yo, pulling up everywhere. You Damn. got a picnic. I'm bringing the cloud cups. Yep, yep. <laughs> That's what Philly does. If you know anything about Philly, summertime is a real <laughs> vibe. Summertime, it turns out we at the park, and that and that's how it is. It's literally like the Will Smith song. That's what we do. Everybody having a cookout. I'm bringing the cloud cups. I'm selling them Jones. I'm trying to get them off. I'm trying to get the name out there. Yep. Anything possible. <clears throat> so, and everywhere you're going is selling. Yeah. Damn. So I'm like, I really got to get the name out there more, though. Okay. So I'm like, all right, I'm going to do an infused dinner party. And I'm going to just serve the gelato as dessert and put it in everybody's hand. Okay, okay. Now everybody got to taste it. Now Say you get hooked to it. Yep, yep. <clears throat> Who's Who made this gelato? Where'd this come from? We did. <laughs> <laughs> yep. We put weed in it. The first frozen dessert with weed. Yep, yeah, okay. All that. <laughs> cool, cool. And from there, you're, you're out of here? Was so, that it? No, no, so... Okay. We're just in Philadelphia at that point. Okay. Then I started getting like DMs and stuff on our Instagram. Then we got like 
two, three hundred followers. Yep. Come to my city, come to my city, come to my city. I'm like, all right, fuck it. We taking this shit on tour. I go to Detroit. Ooh. Detroit showed me crazy love. Whoa. Um they did scary. a whole write up uh, on us. On respect. <laughs> That's scary, but respect. <laughs> we did a whole write up on us in the Detroit Metro Times, first cannabis infused dinner party. Oh fuck. We ran out the spot. It's like twelve thousand dollars. This is all dollars. legal, right? And above board, of course. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, all, all right. that. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> all right, cool, cool. <laughs> but if no risk, no reward, right? Hey. So we did a join in uh in Detroit. We fill up a U Haul with all this uh the dinner equipment and stuff. Okay. Of, we got a uh, Airbnb. We cooking this shit out of that junk. As soon as we get to Detroit, three feet of snow. Oh! I'm like, ain't no way in hell these niggas is showing up for this dinner party. No way. <laughs> three feet of snow. But what what happened? Lo and behold, these Detroit <laughs> different. <laughs> the Midwest is different. They so, pull up. Yo, not caring. I lived in Minneapolis for three years, two feet of snow. So you're not coming to work today? So you you just gonna stay home? Bro, what? You saw that two feet of snow? Pull up. What's up? So I'm like, all right. One person come in, two people come in. Whole dinner table full. They really coming out. Everybody came out. Crazy vibe. I'm like, shit. So we did a dinner and a brunch. I'm like, I'm not coming out here just to do one event. So I do a right. dinner and a brunch. Double up. Yep. Wham, do the dinner that night. I'm like, all right, hopefully everybody still come out the next morning. Full house again the next morning. Damn. We got crazy content. <laughs> everybody had a great time. People in there like, I'm, yeah, I'm having a great time. And I come from an entertainment space, y'all, to see these. Like, I'm a marketing guy. So to see these events, like, G- these not these need these not like a little mom and pop. These are just like five star dining experiences that we traveling around the country. It's a vibe. Probably. It's literally a vibe. Like you created a vibe yeah. in every I started the whole dinner party wave with the weed. Crazy. Crazy. I can stamp that. And he's a <laughs> and he's a DJ too, so that doesn't hurt. At all, but I, right? I wasn't DJing none of the events. I hired DJ A List, DJ Greg Diddy, all Ooh. my folks. I put them on. Come so to the dinner party. So you put heavy hitters in there too. Yeah, I DJ. Uh, shit. What's the shorty's name from Atlanta? She was on uh, Love and Hip Um, Shay Mac. Shay Mac. DJ okay. To join down in Atlanta. <laughs> so. Why you ain't invite me? <laughs> you know what I mean, Lyric, you ain't tell me y'all were. I, I was trying to I, do I, something with Lyric. Lyric, we gonna, uh, we gonna have that talk. We gonna still Lyric, put something together with Lyric for I'm, sure. I'm gonna make sure Lyric tunes in. They're, I mean, they're doing their thing out there. Shout Lyric out to y'all boys, Morehouse. <laughs> Lyric is Lyric is the man in America, bro. Thanks. You say Lyric and somebody knows his yeah, name. That's you, real true. Look, he's a and a good brother. Shout out, shout out to them. Yeah, he came down. He should make a yeah. good time in Atlanta. Yeah, <laughs> best yeah. time I had in Atlanta ever. Easy, easy, <laughs> different. Yeah, pull up. Yeah. <laughs> say less. Right, but... <laughs> say less. Say less. I, I come love through, it. Larry. <laughs> Let me know. <laughs> I'm <laughs> here. <laughs> Look, we you... still grinding. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. So, so from the A, D, the D. I did Atlanta. I did a DC. Okay. I did LA. Okay. I hooked up with the homie Fidel. I did some dinner parties with him. Cool. Cool. I end up. When I tell you this man cultivates the best cannabis in America, Where not even the America, the world. Yeah. I was like, yeah, I got to have this in my product. So, <laughs> and how did, so how did you even connect with it? Like, where did that, that came from your trip? or like? So what? I had a friend that was linking up with him, whatever. Yep. I'm like, yo, I got to meet this guy. <laughs> Real trap, Fidel. If you listening to this joint right now? I flew out there. I didn't even know I was gonna meet you. <laughs> and I was like, "Yo, I gotta meet this guy." I met him. Told him about the gelato. Yep. Told him about everything. He was like, "Yo, I'm gonna hook you up with you know, the, the, you know my my side of things." Yep. He gave it to me. That's fire. Put That's it on. A put it on the label. Fire. Medicated by Fidel's. Yep. And. <laughs> the rest mm. is history. Like, as soon as I, I linked up with him, it was yep. like, oh, yeah. This Out is, of here. This is, this, is, this yeah. is real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you went from, so you went from the gelato, you went, then you went to doing the events, and now, like, what space are you in now? Like, I feel like you're in a spot where you're about 
you about to go. We trying to take over the frozen dessert game right now. <laughs> so right now we have four product lines. Okay. We got, of course, everybody knows us for the loud cups. Loud cups, boom. We got cloud cups, boom. Cloud. Wait, cups. what's the difference between cloud cups? This is CBD. Okay. So are we gonna try the CBD? No, nah, we gotta just one second, we're, one second. We're gonna right, get there. We're gonna roll. Right, we're gonna roll right, it out. Right, right. Just chill. This is why this. <laughs> this is why I bring my boys here. He gonna let me know. All right, bro. Chill, chill out, bro. Relax. So we dropped the loud cups. That's what everybody really knew us for. Got you. So I was like, I can't. Well, it was cloud. Everything was cloud cups initially. At first, right. Everything, right. right. Whatever we sold, it was loud cloud cups. cups. Is recent. Yep. So then I was like, I have to di- uh, distinct. You know. Yeah, the, you gotta. Uh, you know, to distinguish every, between the two. The two yep. brands, whatever. So I was like, all right, I'm gonna call it loud cups. Everybody, like, cool. Yep. So we put the little uh the little man on the uh yep. on the jars. Which was is that you? <laughs> Who is that? So I was like, that's Who the crazy is part guy? about it. He looked like That's the crazy part. If, if anybody has our uh loud cup labels, you see the guy on the front. So I I commissioned Justin Richburg for okay. the dude, yeah, yeah. artist. Yep. I was like, yo, I need a logo. I need a Ooh. I need a weed ice cream man. He sent me back one joint with the fro. I'm like, man, I can't it's not me. Yeah, yeah. I was like, do dreads or some right. some locks or Rasta whatever. Rasta vibe. Yep. So he do the joint. I'm like, this joint is it? Cool. I'm like, this kind of look like some. <laughs> it looks just like bro. Like it looks. I'm like this kind of like. So me. I sent it to my group G. chat with the homies or whatever. I'm like, yo, what y'all think about this nigga? Look like <laughs> it's <G."> you. <laughs> So Justin don't know none of my friends. This shit, shit is crazy. Yep. He literally drew the logo. Look like one of my one of my best. Literally right now. the same boy. <laughs> the same boy. It looks like G a little bit, they but it look literally like... looks like his man. I swear, it's still it's like a little G, and it looks just like. <laughs> so yeah. it's my homie Alan. Alan looks just like the, uh, the yeah. character in this thing. Alan actually wanted to be wanted to be uh, was one of our first investors in Cloud Cups. So. Got me my gelato cart. I mean, boom. Your friends, if they believe in you, if you believe in yourself, <laughs> they got they you. gonna put you on. They got you. That's uh, dope. That's dope. So now you're in stores. So like, what was the progression where you took it out of? I mean, I actually my sister. So we gotta talk about that offline. But my sister has a um event space. Like everybody got an event space now, and she was just talking about, hey, I gotta do a CBD event. So oh, yeah. we'll we'll talk about Put that. Me in the game, coach. Yeah, Pull yeah. Up. Come on, look. You already know I already got you with the bounce back. <laughs> um, so all right, so now where are you now? Like we, so, we did all that. We got cloud cups. Yep. Loud cups. Cool. Cloud cups delta eight. And we have <laughs> our traditional gelato. Okay. <clears throat> oh, shit. Hold on. Yeah, yeah. Have have a little drink. I'm gonna have a drink too. Um Delta Eight, that sounds crazy. What's so that? Delta Eight is um, is derived from CBD. It'll give you the same effects as a Delta Nine, which is a tra- traditional uh, cannabis. Okay. But it, the main, the biggest difference is it doesn't pop up in your urine test. Oh. So bang, I get high all day, go to work, and ain't nobody fucking with me. Wow. Cool. Wow. <laughs> wow. So it's we just launched that in shit. Allentown. Okay. So we have two smoke shops in Allentown that are carrying our uh, our Delta A products, and we have another actual ice cream shop that carries our gelato. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Can we talk about the ice cream shop or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, yeah. they're up in the, It's called uh, Just Chill Creamery. Okay. They sell all our CBD products um, oh. in Allentown. We have a couple stores around Philadelphia that you can get our stuff from. Everything is listed on our website. Dope. Um, What's your? So is it just CloudCups.com? Uh, we working on that. But, okay, uh, <laughs> cool, 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 cool. It's the cloudcupscompany.com. All right, so run me cloud cups. That, no, <laughs> all right, I'll, I'll cut that out. I'll cut it out. Go ahead. Um, And basically, we've just been doing a lot of pop-ups now. We end up just getting a, a gelato card that I'm really excited about. Cool. Um, booking private events with that. Cool. Um, It's really classy looking. Uh, we're going to be doing some weddings. I actually have a wedding booked at the end of the month that I'm doing. That's uh, a vibe. Yeah, you that's know. a cool. I want to be around <laughs> that couple. Like, that's a vibe. That's smart, y'all. Smart, yeah. y'all. DM smart. me. I do private events. All that. We, we, we're gonna. Hook that's up. a good idea. I should have hey, done. I sh- 
I told him to DJ my wife's wedding. I should have thought about her, her her birthday party. I should have thought about that. Uh, why didn't you tell me that? Hey, man. Yo, I'm not. It's all listed on our Instagram. I'm not on a lot of information. <laughs> if you can follow with at Cloud Comes DC. <laughs> I love it. The DC is for dessert company it. and not DC. The city. The city. Yeah. I thought it was DC the city because you were in DC. Yeah, you know I mean, nah, doing nah, your nah. thing in DC too. We were in DC for a little bit. Right, right. That's what the I The nation it knows was. Cloud Cups. I'm going to tell you that. We actually were ranked number 37 by the Today Show as top uh, small ice cream shops uh, in the country. You were so you were in the news too. What were you? Yeah, we're on Channel Six, uh, ABC in Philadelphia, um, as you know, uh, July Fourth special about di- different uh, shops in the country. I mean, in the city. Yo, and you were like one of the top gelato or ice cream like spots. What was that? Philly Mag or something like that? Oh yeah, we were uh, Philly Mag ranked as top. Uh, I think it was like number eight in the city as new, you know, black owned shops and stuff like that. This guy. <laughs> we working I'm And it's not five. just me So like when people see Cloud Code I don't want people Just to think it's me right, The right, whole right. team of us I, I can't it. do this shit By myself Because it's way too much Yo Yo <laughs> I can't tell y'all How proud of y'all I am Cause like I've literally seen The progression Like As you started Like doing the events I mean Just seeing how crazy The events was City to city Like like literally went off. I remember, I, we, so it was crazy. I went on a streak. I did seventeen events in one year. And that's how people really found out about Cloud Cups at the dinner party. Yeah. And it was just like I really don't need to do the dinner party. People been asking me to do it, but it's just like right, right. I'd rather just hang on. Like my homie Layla, uh, uh-huh. Fidel, and them. They do the dinner party. I just come and do the dessert. Right, right. Pull <laughs> up. I don't have to do the whole thing myself. Yeah, I, whatever like, y'all need. I mean, yeah. Be, yeah, all that. I so you're up. literally <laughs> at the level where you just hiring people. Like, all right, I'll I'll pull up if if you want me to pull up. But at this we, point, we working on hiring people. Like yep. it's really just like my aunt. And me in the actual kitchen. Okay. Drew, um, he runs our production. Okay. Taj runs all the marketing and stuff like that. Uh, Got it. It's just like, I mean, it's a team effort. Yeah. So the supply chain is intact. And now the next level is... It's expanding right now. We're putting freezers in locations. That's the that's the goal. You got a business with a, with a that needs a wholesale situation with some freezers. We're trying to put it in there. Wow. We're trying to be in Whole Foods by the end of the year. How many states are you in? We're in 10 states right now. So you're out of here. <laughs> we he working just, on it. He just said Whole Foods, y'all. I'm he trying to be at least Foods, on somebody y'all. regional floor plan with this traditional gelato that you see in front of you right now. That you got to give it a little taste. Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. All right, I got some spoons right there. I'm going to try to see. We got, no, no, they're uh, both regular. They're both right, regular. Right. So I got lemon and I got I got the berry mafia. All right, cool. You know. You going to try it with me? I mean... <laughs> All right, let's see the berry. We gotta have a. We gotta have a whole team try. So we'll, we'll do it, and we'll have. There's four spoons we'll in there, so you can just pass it around real quick, right, or cool. how you wanna do it. Mic down for a second. All right. Yeah, you know I had to come through with the goodies, man. Fresh gelato. Gel- actually, I brought two sorbets today. He's so a gelatieri. Gelatier. Oh, gelatier. <laughs> Say it right. Gelatier. You... Gelatieri. 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 We're going to let them slide. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a lot of G's over here. <laughs> All right, we got to we gotta... we pass that around. We got to pass it to the people. That's amazing. That's that's lemon sorbetto right there. Like a lemon, it'd be like a lemon water ice. But the difference between my my stuff and like a water ice is, is I'm actually making a real sorbet base using actual real ingredients. Gee, how you get this drawn up? Come on, man. Come on. I'm All sure you gotta that. do, come on, yo. Look, look, watch this, yo. What you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> These not even the childproof that's, ones. That's what, you, that's what you gonna do to me on my own podcast. Listen, I mean, this is why y'all don't bring your friends <laughs> nowhere, y'all. God damn. It's, it's, if this ain't a. 
John just ain't been in the gym this week. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> you know I'll be in the gym. I took. I'm busy. I'm busy right now. Yo, this is bomb. Yeah, so the Berry Mafia is a combination of um, strawberries, raspberries, strawberries, raspberries, yeah, strawberries, and blueberries. Um, I guess we just um, you know I mean, doing your thing. Appreciate. It. Yeah, 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 we gotta. Oh, I, I still, I'm, I'm healthy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope. Not gonna work. Um. Yeah, so I'm just working on just you know making some family friendly stuff, giving right. stuff that we can put in on some on some store tops. Basically. Yeah, yeah. If y'all know Jeff at, at Brown Shop, right? Let him know that I'm trying to get in there. <laughs> I'm in there, Jeff. Nah, Whole Foods sounds like the move though. Whole Foods would be yeah. amazing, bro. Yeah, I'm trying to get in there. Like I I literally see it right now on the Whole Foods shelf. That lemon is amazing, bro. <laughs> so what what other flavors do you have? I'm about to take that home, dog. So the crazy part about it is I have 80 flavors. I got a whole list. I need like 10 of them want. in my freezer right now. <laughs> I just be trying to run through them like that. You can get all these joints in TAC. All I hear about is banana <laughs> pudding all day. My boys can say, yo, you need this banana pudding. So we got to work on the supply chain piece. So I did to enough- put the, the banana pudding on the mat. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, it's the best banana pudding in America. <laughs> yo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we need yo. Next time you come in here, we need this banana pudding. Listen, How do we mass produce? So is it like you dropping this like uh, like they off whites? Because I feel like the <laughs> banana pudding only comes out, but so often. Nah, it come out. It just go away real quick. Dog. So we dropping them like a brand new Supreme out here. Like uh, I was like I, I was like Aunt Gina, I might need about ten banana puddings tomorrow. That's it. <laughs> Yo, and that's all you get. You had a whole cloud cups floor <laughs> popping just off the banana pudding coming out. Um, Yo, I'm I'm crazy. Jones home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so I'm crazy proud of you. <laughs> yeah. The banana pudding is bananas, but that lemon joint is fire. <laughs> Different. So like last year at Weed Stock in Delaware, mm-hmm. excuse me, I ended up doing a uh uh berry mafia and I mixed it because I was running low on flavors with our dark chocolate sorbet and it ended up being crazy. Ooh. Like Ooh. those two flavors Ooh. together, I was yeah. like, oh man. <laughs> so I'm about to do it like a half and half joint, like a half and half point. I'm gonna start I'm gonna start switching it up and getting a little more creative and stuff with my flavors. And you know, try to expand my 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 palate and your right. palate at the same time. That's dope. That's like refreshing, like because I make it with real shit, <laughs> bro. So like every everything this you ain't do, water is, in, this ain't water ice. This is sorbet. This ain't ice cream. Wait, so all right, so all right, so what's what? I'm dumb. I'm you gonna have to break it down. He's a gelati eddy. A gelati eddy. You already yo, know. <laughs> yo, get it right. He's a gelati eddy. Listen. All right. So, when they put me they, when they put me in the uh in the multi continent uh magazine and these Italian people said they knew who I was, I said, yeah. I'm gonna just run with this. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. Put me in a magazine, four page spread. (laughs) Yeah, I'm I'm here for that. I'm I'm, here to grow this brand. I'm here to put on. I'm here. It's it's not just about, you know, the brand. We're we're actually making a healthier version of ice cream, a healthier dessert. Right. I'm actually going to launch some uh, low glycemic later in the year. Oh, dope. Dope. For uh, people with like uh, uh, diabetes and stuff like that can enjoy stuff. I'm, I'm really trying to just help black people enjoy something, a dessert that's healthy. Yep. And if you can get a version that gets you some THC in it. And the reality I is bet. like, yeah. And 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 if there is somebody who has diabetes and maybe the THC might help them out. Then that's a lot of, like, I actually have a lot of people, uh, customers who are like cancer patients. Yep, yep. That actually like use and that's this stuff how it as comes a, full wellness, circle. That's dope. a wellness yep. product at first. It, absolutely. Like, if you look at our CBD cups, it says a drop of wellness in every scoop. That's dope. We're not just here, you know. It was it, it was fun, you know. We made it. Who a, gave we, you that? 
Who, where you get that from? I ain't gonna lie, Sheena from Cannabis Noir. She, she, yo, you <laughs> she need dropped to, that jib you on You need me, to, really? yeah, you need to <laughs> trademark that now. Now. Get it. I love uh, it. So, like, we're really trying to hear a producer, actual, a, a whole holistic wellness product that you can enjoy and understand that you're helping yourself and bettering your life by the quality and the quality of our product. You just got into Whole Foods. I'm buying it. <laughs> I'm buying it. I've been doing this distribution thing for so long. Uh, distribution meaning I've been doing like analytics and distribution and planning for like all these big companies for a long time. Like they need to buy into something. Like it, from a holistic perspective, where we're going as a country, like it just makes sense in a Whole Foods. I'm in and you, we going international, baby. Where we at? So, I mean, honestly, Yo. um, that's actually, you know, the next... I yeah. met Colin Williams maybe maybe like four okay. or five years ago. He, he's a native of Antigua. Okay. Um, we're actually working on our first franchise lo uh, location in Antigua with the, uh, some political connections that we met down there. Um, Can I and the working on trying to get a, a cannabis grow in Antigua. So we're, you know, we're forward pressing this cannabis, mo cannabis movement because we actually want to be a part of the legwork and like the structure of how it becomes global. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the reality is, there are not that many people that look like us in that space at all. They don't want us in this space, so I'm I'm here pressing the gas to the floor. I don't day. I don't know who <laughs> needs to hear this, who needs to invest, but like, it's not too many young folks like us that like you started from literally the bottom of it. Like, I mean, you you did this with your own too, like yeah. gelato. Yeah, we got it. So we ended up expanding some of our businesses through, you know, through our uh, infrastructure. So, cool. well, I kept running in trouble with was our labels. Labels would be super expensive. Cool. I'm doing all these flavors, and people was like, "Well, we just cut down on your flavors." Well, no, I'm not stunting my creativity because I, I it costs right. money. I'm gonna figure out a way around it. So what we did was we it. bought a printer. I love it. So now we got a printing business. You want labels? I got you. <laughs> Said this isn't. I this, print my own label. This isn't gonna up. stop me. Like, why would I let that stop me? Come on. So, so any other gems for the young entrepreneurs out there? Like, like, especially people in this space, because I feel like we need more of us in it. Yeah, I mean, just believe in yourself and just keep knocking on that door because, like, they might, they not might always knock or wiggle at the first, you know, the first attempt. But like, there's always a way around. There's always somebody that's going to believe in you more than you believe in yourself. Right. And that's one of the realest things I've ever learned. Because, like, at times where, like, I wanted to quit all this stuff, and I don't know if it's going to work, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah. It's a million things about, me about being an entrepreneur that you don't know. So many uncertainties about moving forward. <laughs> and sometimes you just want to quit. Heck but yeah. at right at that time, you're about to quiz, but you're about to have your biggest breakthrough and your miracle because God is right there pushing you through the next the next loophole, whatever you got to go through to be where you got to be. Hell yeah. And I'm assuming that you went crazy during the pandemic, right? <laughs> I mean, the pandemic actually, like, boosts sales and stuff. For oh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, thinking. like, everybody's at home. Everybody want to feel good. So, like... Heck yeah. Like, I'm, I mean, like, I don't I don't got to go to work. So, um... I said, heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be at home eating these cloud cups. <laughs> hey, Les, I can get my, my work day. done. I'll be all right. <laughs> yeah, so... I love it. I love it. Yo, I'm I'm hyped for cloud cups. I can't wait to see what it does. Um, We appreciate the gems for the young entrepreneurs, but... um. You gotta come back up here, <laughs> so we that can see pudding. where it's going. <laughs> you already know. I need the banana pudding. The pudding go crazy. Dog, we what's your number? So, what are your top flavors? Like, if I'm in the store, where what what should I go to besides the banana pudding? And this uh, lemon is fire. Like, I like all of our flavors. Okay. Are of course, good. Gonna say I'm that. not gonna, but like all of our flavors are good in their own respect. Like. Okay. I got a honey lavender that's kind of going crazy right now. Honey lavender? Yeah. So like <laughs> He's a gelati. Yeah. I got a dark I got a dark uh a dark chocolate raspberry that got to kind of go crazy. Um Damn. Uh I got a caramel apple it tastes just like the caramel sticks we had when we just Yeah. I got uh the the I got a biscoff I did with Fidel. He got two exclusive flavors. I got Nutella. 
and Biscoff, like the little airplane cookie you eat. Damn. Shit. Five. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I can't. I, this is why I can't sit down with him, yo. But like, I got a lot of flavors. I love the Biscoffs on the plane, bro. <laughs> Them drums go. Fire, bro. So, bro. <laughs> bro. That's the only two flavors I make with double strength. So everybody's like, yeah, you got to make a, a cup with a double strength. So you that's gotta, our double you strength You got to upcharge flavor. for them. It is upcharge. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. That makes so, sense. Our, our, so another thing I do want to put out real quick out there is that like, our link to order is extremely easy. <laughs> All right. What's the link? Go what's right link? in our bio. It literally has fingers pointing saying, order here. <laughs> Yo, I, <laughs> Or you have to click on it and just go through whatever selection right. you want. Everything is a drop down menu. So just go in there, drop down. We do shipping, pick up, and delivery. Boom. I got you. All right. <laughs> where where else can we find you? Um, NJ Weed Man. If you just want to go over there and pick up some TAC cups. Cool. You go out in Trent, New Jersey. It's literally across the street from City Hall. <laughs> wow. Uh, wow. Walk right up it's in legal. there, get you, a, get you a sack and a cup at the same time. Wow. Um, our kitchen is located in Kensington. Okay. You put in the order, we'll give you the address and all that other good stuff. And how about online or like the dot? The, the, the cloudcupscompany.com. We're redoing our website right now, so it's just a landing page. But our job form and how you can order and contact and everything, it's cool. right there on our Instagram. Cool. Just the Cloud Cups, Cloud Cups DC on IG. Cool. Perfect. My man, I appreciate you. No doubt. That was fire. <laughs> Yo, next sessions, we're going to get the banana pudding, dog. I might have to charge you for that, Joe. All right. <laughs> say less. I got you. I probably owe you a couple of hours at this point. we going to get you through the. Uh, my my sister's spot. Yeah, yeah, we, we gonna, gonna put, put it together. Connect. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'll try and get her to just do the ice cream thing. We'll yeah, make yeah. sure. Yeah, you know I mean, but yo, we appreciate you. No doubt. We no gotta doubt. get you back through the sessions, bro. <laughs> Say less. I'm All here. Right. Peace. All right.